What's up guys, Max here, and today I'm bringing you another video. Uh, this one, I was thinking about making a guide on uh, the Nightmare Zone, but that's been done so much that I figure, why would I do that? If you don't know what it is, uh, look it up. There's plenty of guides out there. Basically, it's a uh, arena where you go in and you can fight the quest bosses that you've fought already. So depending on the amount of quests you've done and the, bo the bosses you've killed during them, uh, you can fight more monsters and uh, therefore getting more points. So the more quests you've done, the more it's advantageous. Um, but I haven't done too many, but I can still get a good amount of um, rewards from it. Uh, yeah, so this video basically is going to be telling you what um, what rewards to pick. I'll, I can walk over there now. It's it's by Yanel if you've never been there, and it costs a little bit of money for each round. I suggest doing it on hard mode if you haven't done it before. And yeah, but here's the rewards. Um, pretty good rewards actually. Uh, a lot of a lot of good stuff. I'd suggest honestly. Um, well, we'll go through it, because I'm really not sure which ones I should buy, but uh, I'm, this video is going to be finding that out. So, uh, yeah, I'll go through it a little bit, and we'll test some of the different um, costs. And, yeah, so let's start out. Um, first, I'm going to look at the herb box, which is the only one that's pretty up in the air as what, to what you'll get. And the herbs are unidentified, so I'll have to go identify those, which m might be a pain. I should probably check what herbs I have right now, too. Um, but, uh, yeah, so here's the rewards, and you can also note, this. these took me about an hour to get, but I also spent a lot of money on absorption and overload potions, too, so there are a lot of points on them. So, uh, if you are max melee, and you have all the quests done, and um, you have, like, great gear, you can probably... Uh, get a lot more than this probably 20 to 30 boxes an hour no problem so um yeah let me just look at the herbs i do have i have my toad flax my snapdragons those don't drop from these boxes if you didn't know um i want to identify that or i could just drop it huh i might just leave it in there but uh here let's see herb i only have that one so i don't think that'll affect it i'll just there will be one extra herb. I don't know what it's going to be. So, um, let's see. You can take one. Bank all. And I think this will bank all of my herbs as they go along. So I'll just uh, pick them out and then I'll go identify them. I'm going to have to go to the place where you identify them for gold. But if you have higher herbal or level, that's even better for you. So, yeah, let me, um, let's, let's look at these. Let's get them all noted. Um, here, that, here, let's see, herb take all these out um, yeah it looks like you do get a lot of the common ones much more often I can identify some of those I'll probably do that and then I'll go identify the ones that I can identify hopefully there's a good amount of Ranars in there uh, I need them for prayer potions but yeah I'll, d I'll do that and then I'll be right okay guys um, back this is uh, I I got all the herbs this is it it's not that much actually but uh, I feel like if you had uh, full Darox Max combat and all that, you could probably make about four to five times this. And keep in mind, it's like the best strength slash combat experience in the game. So this is about 150k, maybe a little bit more. And um, uh, yeah, the Ranars themselves are about 100k. And then everything else, I would I would estimate about 50k for all the rest of it. So I made about 150k in an hour and got amazing strength experience. No, I don't want to get my strength up anymore. So I'm pretty sure if you were if you were uh, max combat, you would get uh, closer to four or five hundred k an hour doing this. And uh, if you're in the rumble with um, protect melee on, you could probably get a lot more. Now I'm gonna go back to uh, the place and look at the other rewards and just do a quick calculation of for the hundred thousand points that I spent or ninety five thousand, how much uh, of other stuff could I get and how much would that sell for? So we'll see if I did better with these or with the other thing. Okay, we're back at the rewards chest, and let me pull the calculator up. Um, let's see, we have pure essence. Let's try that out. So 95,000 points divided by 70 uh, is 1.357 pure S divided by, or times, uh, they're worth about 50 GP each. So that's only 67K there. So let's try something else real quick. Let me look up a price. Okay, a vial of water costs uh here we'll, you can see it there valve water costs uh, 145 points each and they cost 100 gold each roughly so 95,000 divided by 
140. I can already tell that this is going to be a little bit less. I hope I'm right. 655 times 100 gold. Yeah, it was a little, tiny bit less. So that's about 65k. So it seems they're pretty consistent so far. Let me look up one more thing. We'll try snape grass. Okay, snape grass is 150 gold each, and it's oh that this one might be a little bit better. Uh, let's see, 95,000 divided by 175 times uh, it's about 150 each. So that's a little bit more, 81k. Um, let's see. So it's looking like herbs is going to be the best method by far, but we'll just check red spiders' eggs, and then I think that'll be. It. Okay, uh, they're about th uh, 250 each. So divided by, oops, okay, nine five divided by 250. Nope, that's not right either. Divided by 300 times 250. So that's 80k. That's about the same too. And I guess we might as well check a few other things. If none of them are selling. In the in Zybez, then I'll just call it there. These are pretty useful too, I'm pretty sure. Okay, guys, so it looks like everything is about the same or less. So herbs is definitely your best bet if you're uh, if you're buying these, especially since Ranars are so high right now. If they go down, then you're a little bit less likely to make as much money. So um, if you can do this, do it now because now is your time to really uh, get things going. If you're training for God Wars, now is the time to do this and uh, make some money as well as get the fastest experience in the game. Uh, I'm going to go back to mage training now. I'm about to hit 83. And yeah, that's about it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a like if you did. And uh, I will have much more uh, PvP videos when I get my stat and my, um, when I get all my quests done and my venge and everything. And I'll be a lot better off and I can do some fun combinations of stuff. Like, I was playing around with a D-Long and I was doing well, but I couldn't get kills because it just wasn't, didn't spec high enough. So, uh, yeah. I think that's about it, and I hope you enjoyed it. Alright guys, see you soon.